Hi guys and welcome back to another video. This week I'm going to do something a bit different. I'm going to take this box here and I'm going to unbox it on camera. I've been looking forward to this because this actually has the July Birch Box in here and this is my first ever Birch Box so I've never ordered with them before. It would be interesting to see what's inside. Um, for July they were also doing an extra code where you could get an extra surprise 5 items so I'm really interested to see what's inside this box and obviously what I make of the items themselves. Because I ordered from Birchbox as well, they've given me a friends code where you can get £5 off your own Birchbox. So I'm going to include that link in the description box down below if any of you guys want to use it. Um, I think I get something back out of it. I'm not entirely sure. Obviously, it's my first time using Birchbox, so we'll see. Um, but, I mean, £5 off a box, which is only £10, that's 50% off. You're more than welcome to go ahead and use that, and then you can make your own Birchbox videos. <laughs> So I'm going to crack open this and first of all see what's inside. So flash forward to the fact that I've cut this out of this, throw that away. And this was the July Birch Box. Now what I quite like about Birch Box is that they have these really cute boxes. Like the boxes themselves actually come like as a really adorable set. So I'm going to open this up and see what's inside. So the first thing that's inside the July Birch Box, and I'm assuming is the thing that smells, because something smells amazing in this box, is this refreshing foaming shower gel in fresh eucalyptus and rosemary. I would definitely say that that's the thing that's smelling. I'm so looking forward to trying that. It's from the Ritual of Hammam. Hammam? Hammam? Um, I'll do like a little clip shot of everything as we go through so you can sort of see what's in the box itself and then maybe I can do a testing video with all these products and see what I make of them all. The next thing I've got is the Percy and Reed London Hair Perfectly Perfecting Wonder Overnight Recovery. So what this is, uh, what I think this is is an overnight recovery to rehydrate your hair so anyone with dry hair would uh, really appreciate this I suppose let's give it, a, give it a smell oh wow that smells amazing as well um, that might definitely be worth a try because I've moved back down south to the seaside my hair started going really brittle at the ends again the next thing I see is this Balanced Me Natural Skincare Flash Cleanse Micellar Water. This little cute micellar water bottle. So it'd be interesting. I've never used micellar water, so it'd be interesting to see if it does get rid of makeup without breaking me out and whether it gets rid of waterproof makeup because I tend to have a lot of that. The next thing I see is this Pop Beauty Bright Up Your Life Eyeshadow Trio in champagne mocha so that's what that's got that's got this very cute champagne color and then it goes to a warm brown and then a darker more sort of neutral brown color and it comes with one of those little applicators that we all used to have when we were like 10 which is quite cool always up for trying new makeup the next thing I've got is the English Laundry Puff Femme. My French accent is appalling and I won't actually try to do that again. Which is a cute little um, perfume sample. So it'd be interesting. I can't smell it through this thing, but it'll be interesting to see what that smells like. Lastly, I have the Benefit Cha Cha Tint, which I believe is a lip and cheek oh, look at that cheek and lip tint so this is adorably cute oh and it comes with the tiniest little applicator oh it's almost like a paintbrush so I'm gonna be so excited to try that out that is everything for the July Birch Box. 
but because I ordered the extra box they actually sent a second surprise bag I mean this bag in general is adorable straight away and I really needed a new makeup bag and it's like um, like a waterproof material so that'd be great for going on holiday and oh my god so much stuff so the first thing I've got here is a cow shed cow pat moisturizing hand cream which doesn't sound very appetizing but oh <laughs> well it's now a nose cream um, so may as well try that now because it's all, all over everywhere uh, it it smells quite sort of herbally it's got shea butter and cocoa butter in it oh and it's got grapefruit bitter orange leaf oils coriander cinnamon lavender oh, it's got absolutely all sorts in it which is what's giving it that very unusual smell but let's see oh wow okay so when you rub that in it becomes very strong very strong it's like all the scents are hitting you at once I'm not really sure if I like it and um, in fact I'm not gonna lie I think that's awful that's like when you walk into a garden center that's got all those you know like all those perfumes that little old ladies really love and they go around and they spray them all at once to smell them and you just get hit by an abundance of scents mixed with plants that's what that smells like. I mean, as a hand cream, that's made my hands feel amazing, but at the smell of it, it's disgusting. I reckon... I, do you know what? I reckon my nan would love this. I am going to give this to my nan and see if she really likes that. So, that's that first thing. That's the first thing from this bag. The next thing I've got is this... Okay, I'm... Correct me if I'm wrong. Aribe, 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 dry texturizing spray. So it doesn't smell of anything. I'm not really sure what a texturizing spray would do that a hairspray wouldn't do. Um, spray where you want volume. A brilliant alternative to dry shampoo. So we can definitely try that one out. Next in the bag is. Wow, I'm really not going to pronounce any of this. Okay, I'm just going to insert a clip here. This is an antioxidant, anti-stress moisturising cream, I think. Um, apply in the morning, face and neck. So we'll see what that's like. It smells nice. I mean, I can't really get over the weird plant smell that I've got going on in my hands, but that smells reasonably nice. And the last two things that I've got in here is I've got a Meet and Mia brown light brow liner in 022. And I have just run out of my current brow pencil. So I think it might be a bit light for my brows. But we can see if it works. And if not, I can give it to my sister because she has got lighter hair than me. And this is a Lord and Berry conceal it crayon concealer I mean I'm gonna have to find one of those pencil sharpeners that takes chunky pencils but that seems pretty cool as well I mean so for £10 I've got all these different products and I am really looking forward to opening my August one because I think the August one is mermaid themed I mean the boxes anyway so I'm really intrigued to see what comes out of that and I think I believe with the August box you get a full size spectrum brush I know so many youtubers rave about spectrum brushes so it would be great to have one for myself and to try it out that's all for the videos for today if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up if you use the Birchbox link I will that I am going to leave down in the description then please leave a comment and if you'd like to see more videos from me, or you'd like to see some sort of a tester video, or even a August Birch Box opening video, then please subscribe to my channel. And I hope to see you in my next video. Okay, goodbye!